The government has revealed they plan to house the first asylum seekers on the Bibby Stockholm barge in the next few days. It's expected around 50 people will be accommodated on the vessel off the coast of Dorset. Well, let's get more on this with our correspondent, Lewis Warner. Now, Lewis, uh, it's been a controversial policy for the government. Yes, it has, and it is looking like it will happen in the next few days. There have been uh, delays, legal challenges and health concerns, but today the Immigration Minister, Robert Jenrick, said it would happen in the coming days. The first group, as you say, would be around 50 asylum seekers on board the Bibby Stockholm barge, uh, which is currently docked at Portland Port in Dorset. It's hoped housing them there instead of in hotels around the country will save the government a significant amount of money. It's currently forking out around £6 million a day day it, while it processes their claims. But the problem is that process is taking a very, very long time. Labour claimed today it would take until 2036 to clear the current backlog of failed asylum seekers, which stands at around 40,000 people. All that time, there are those health concerns uh, on board the vessel too. An NHS Dorset document revealed the danger posed by uh, uh, the possibility of a disease like diphtheria, possibly spreading among residents and among staff there too. And of course, there are security concerns uh, after social media accounts from right wing uh, posters posted about the possibility of wanting to try and sink the ship with asylum seekers on board. And of course, the Prime Minister has made this one of his key five key pledges uh, of the year. So it is very important that this scheme, when it does start, goes well for the government. Lewis Warner, thank you very much indeed.